Hello everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today, Damien and I are over here at Trilogy Sunstone, a 55 plus active adult retirement community. And they just grand opened their condos. They have three different floor plans to choose from. You have the Vantage, the Crescendo, and the, what's it called, Ascent. All right, so we're gonna take a tour of the Crescendo collection, which is the largest condo unit here at Trilogy Sunstone. And it's the middle collection because it's all the way up on the third floor. The other two collection, you have the Ascent, which is a smaller 1,300 square foot one. And then you have the Vantage, which is around 1,700 square feet. So this one is the only one that has the elevators leading up. And it looks like they have one, two, two. To, um, I don't know what's gonna, the status is. I'm going to find out more when I talk to my sales rep today what's going on with these. I did hear that they do have a wait list and the next lot release probably won't be until summer and it's an 18 month build out. I don't have the HOA information just yet because my sales rep was talking to a client, but I will post all that information on my website and I will post that link down in the description below. So that this is the Crescendo at 2758 square feet with two bedrooms, two and a half baths, and a den plus a two car garage. Base price starting at 614900 So I like this wide entry. And this is kind of like the similar concept to what Trilogy Summerlin was doing with their condos. They're a little different layout, but the idea, right? Wow, sounds like a party up there. Yeah. I should have done this one first. This is the elevator if you want to go up, which we're not. And then here is the garage, which is a, a nice wide car garage. Yeah. It's pretty big. That's it's deep. Yeah, it's deep and wide. You have your, well, that's the. That's a plumb for the water softener. Yeah, where's the water heater at? Oh, interesting. That's for the elevator. Huh. Very interesting. Look, they have that kind of garage door opener. Ooh, those are cool. Yeah. And there's the water softener. No, that's the, that's the water line. Yeah. Where's the water heater at? It wasn't here. No. Oh, you're right. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Try to avoid these people. Hopefully, you guys can hear me because it's kind of loud. So there's nothing on the second floor because you have the two other units next to you. But look at how tall. That's beautiful. Oh. I got my workout for today. Yeah. Okay. Did she come up? Wow. It's big. <sighs> okay. Elevator. That's where you uh, exit from the elevator. I think I'm going to do the kitchen first. I like that they did the flat panel. It's not soft close. Can you turn on those lights? Look how pretty. Wow. This is beautiful. It's huge. This is neat. It's a little desk area. This one actually has a true pantry, which is very nice. I love these countertops. I think this is a quartzite. Yeah, with the waterfall. Yeah. They have a wine fridge. I mean, look at all these cabinets. Lot of storage. Five burner. What is this? Oh, what's that called again? Oh yeah, I forgot that name. Of that. Me too. 
I forget what they call that brand. It's a high-end brand. Now, when you buy, you know, you're going to choose your different appliance packages. It's called Gen Air. Gen Air, that's right. And then with Trilogy Sunstone, you have like a $45,000 deposit for a design studio where you go in and there's about five different design options like modern farmhouse, uh, design country chic or classic chic, and you get to choose from those five different design options what you want to direct, decorate the house with. I like this little right here. This is probably the primary. You got lots of cabinets and storage. Lots of windows too. It's very bright. And they have all that recessed lighting. Yeah. There you go. You had it. Let's look at this bathroom. Can't talk with all these people just hanging around. They're having a party up here. <laughs> the double vanity with the gray hone quartz countertops, the same white plain flat panel cabinets. They did a nice job with the design options. It's kept it in the, the grayish family, you know, the beigeish gray with the herringbone pattern. Then this is a bigger closet than we've seen in most of them. And of course, this is a custom closet. This home will not come with this type of closet. That's something you'll have to have built yourself. I like all these little nooks, lots of storage areas. Even the hallways are a little wider. Half bath. Love the floors. So it's probably yeah. an engineered hardwood as well. Then you have bedroom number two right here. I mean, look at all these views. Look at that view. Very beautiful. Yeah, I think these will do well. Then you have an ensuite with bedroom number two. So that's a nice feature to have as well. And then this is the laundry room. They put some honeycomb tiles with the stacked gray horizontal backsplash. Looks classy. Yeah. And I like... So this is the den. Very nice. Since it's so loud out there, we're going to look at this floor plan right here. People need to leave. <laughs> Don't they know other people want to look? They're socializing. This ain't no socialing. Yeah. All right. So let's see. Living room, kitchen, primary bedroom, bath, bedroom two. So the study can be opted into a third bedroom. So that's good to know. Let's go take a look at that balcony if we can get through. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Like yeah. Excuse me. Excuse me. That's okay. Beautiful. People are so rude. No. They just don't consider what's going on. Hey, people want to look at this house, don't congregate. <laughs> so the nice thing is about these condos. It's like I said in the beginning, I think I said it in this video, is that it's going to make a U-shoop around the Kabachan Club. So that's the clubhouse, which has awesome friggin' amenities. We love the Kindred in Maine. We go eat there all the time. This is actually probably on the top of our one of our favorite retirement communities, wouldn't you say? And then the pool is so beautiful. And the nice thing is, is they have people serving you during the summertime yeah, even from alcohol. the Kindred in Maine. Even alcohol, if you want to have, like you're at a spa, you're at a... Resort yeah. in Las Vegas, yeah. but you're in your own community. They pamper you. Yeah, and the nice thing, oh, you got a, a little glimpse of the strip down there. Again, you're going to have these unobstructed mountain views, at least from the peaks, um, you know, because these are all going to be single story. So the views are here. And the base price, I think it's actually pretty good. Something like this in Summerlin, this size would be over a million dollars. And the condo in the Trilogy and Summerlin. views of mountains and stuff? Too. Yeah. So this is the crescendo 
uh, which is 2758 square feet with two beds, two and a half baths, a den, and a two car garage. Base price starting at $614,900. That's just the base price. That doesn't include any upgrades that you select. And I would go inside and talk, but those people are just congregating and, and they're in my way. <laughs> yeah, my friggin' way, people. <laughs> Move or lose it, sister. Exactly. <laughs> it's not time for social hour. Uh, let us know in the comments what you think. I have sold a lot of homes in Trilogy sunstone um i love this community and also i've posted a lot of information on my website they just can go to go to neighborhoods in las or oh my yeah yeah neighborhoods in las vegas.com or i've posted a link down in the description below to this trilogy website where it goes over all the information you need to know including hoa i don't have the hoa offhand right now because those salespeople were busy but i will have it on my website Anyway, folks, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, and we'll see you on the flip side.